It's icky out there. That makes this a perfect time for a nice little tour of a cabin in the woods. There's a grand total of not one, not two, not three, but four bedrooms. There are four bedrooms in this place. A fully equipped kitchen with garbage disposal. Three and a half rooms dedicated to taking care of business. The living room to relax and watch movies. You can keep warm by the fireplace on the main floor. Or kick back by the downstairs fireplace. A dining room table with the centerpiece to match the seasons. Shoot some pool on a rainy day. Or a snowy day, depending on the season. Make sure mama says it's okay for you to play that there foosball. I really wish I were good at shooting pool. I got one in. But the best part about this place is definitely the hot tub. That was a really fun video to make and I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it for you. This part of North Carolina, like I just absolutely love coming up here. Aside from having extended family up here, there is just also so much stuff up here to do just between like the hiking, the skiing, the snowboarding, mountain biking, whitewater rafting, rock climbing. Like, you're gonna hear me say this a lot this year, just in like the different places that I take you to, but it's it really is true. You really can just spend like an entire lifetime exploring just this one little nugget, this one little part of North Carolina, and never get bored, never run out of things to do, and never actually see it all. What I think I failed to show you around here though, is just like so many of the little intricate details that make this place like, well, what I think makes it very homey, kind of like in the woods, but also still sort of modern. You see, my parents actually, they own the place. This is their rental cabin, but we're only here like two or three weeks out of the year, and the rest of the time, they just rent it out. Um, so whenever they were buying the place, my mom and I, we flew up here a couple times to just get some stuff to furnish it out, and we had like a blast putting stuff together and making like, oh, this is like, it could be like a girl's room, this could be a guy's room, here's the master bedroom, here's like another room downstairs in the basement, and this is how we want to furnish off the basement, and this is how this area should be furnished. So it's really neat being here just because I kind of see different things that my mom and I picked out together and it kind of, it just brings back a lot of memories and I really enjoy being here. If you would like to stay here, I've got a link below in the description for you to actually check the place out online. And if you want to book a sweet little North Carolina vacation, you can do that. You know what else I just realized? This is vlog number eight. That means that this is the start of the second week of this daily vlog series. And I don't know about you guys, but I've had a ton of fun doing it. It's been very challenging, just figuring out like a flow and getting into a good rhythm for the daily vlogs, knowing when to vlog, when not to vlog, trying to figure out my editing style too. That's a thing. Um, but I'm really stoked to keep on, keep on doing this. I hope you guys are enjoying them. And if you are, it'd be awesome if you were to give me a thumbs up and maybe a little comment here or there. That'd be really cool, because I like interacting with you guys. It's a lot of fun. Um, but for now, I've, I've got some stuff to do, so I'll see you tomorrow. Whew. Good news, I remembered to take out my phone. That was good. <laughs>